It's so hard to even process the fact that your child is gone, let alone the fact that, that she's gone because she ended her own life. Mm -hmm. And just was like this all around happy person on the outside. But what people didn't see is that on the inside, she was struggling with a nonverbal learning disability and anxiety and depression. Constantly judging herself based on what she was seeing, like on Instagram and Facebook. I didn't know the extent to which how much social media i think played a role in in her mental health we are not doing enough to support our young people in terms of suicide prevention they're like people only talk about it once it's happened once someone has died or if someone is in a crisis situation and they're like why can't we be talking about mental health all the time in the hopes of preventing someone from getting to that situation? The biggest lessons that I've learned through this whole process that I wish I had known when Liv was alive is that um, when your child is struggling, it's really important to just sit down with them and, and say, I'm here for you. I love you. And no matter what you say, nothing can scare me. And just sit with your child and let them talk. They just want to be heard.